There's simply a, uh, a format for our unit vector. Okay, now in this case we have our vector u is three is three zero. But remember, a unit vector has a length of one, right? That is the total length of a unit vector is one. So obviously you can see if we plotted this vector right now, three comma zero, that has a length of three, right? We want to write it so it has a length of one. So we take the vector, which is three comma zero, and divide it by its magnitude. Now remember the magnitude of a vector is equal to u1 squared plus u2 squared. Now again, guys, remember just the u1 and u2, those just represent your components of your vector. I know in our previous notes it was v's, because that, that was the name of that vector we first talked about. So all I simply need to do is go ahead and take this. So now I plug in my information. So u is 3 comma 0. To find the magnitude, it's going to be 3 squared plus 0 squared. Well, the square root of, or 3 squared plus 0 squared is just going to be 9. The square root of 9 is 3. So therefore, I can rewrite this as 1 third, 3 comma 0. Or the preferred method for this class, for me, is going to be to distribute that. So we're left with 1 comma 0. Which obviously, if you just go under the reasoning of the vector, remember a unit vector has to have the same direction, right? Remember we talked about the, when we did the unit vector? It was still on the same vector, but it just had a, a 1. So this one, you could obviously just already know, oh, well, I know the unit vector is going to be 1, because a unit vector can only have a distance of 1. All right. 